Hello, guys. And welcome to Tarzan. This is a video game that, um, I played a lot when I was a kid. I liked the movie a lot also. It's one of my favorite Disney movies. Probably not my very favorite, but... Still one of my favorites. And, um... I still really enjoy this game. Um, that's just the intro, but we're not going to watch that. I think that was the original trailer for the movie, but... Um, we're going to go ahead. I'm going to check my options really quickly. Okay, good. I have it on easy. So, I'm going to go ahead and hit start game. And we're going to play Tarzan. Level 1, Welcome to the Jungle. So of course we start out with, um, Young Tarzan. And those were some bananas right there. Um, the bar at the bottom of the screen, like that green bar there, that's your health over by where the floating Tarzan head is. These are coins that you can collect. And if you get 100 coins, um, Um, if you get 100 coins, at the end of the level, it will count up each 100 coins and give you another life. You start out with 6 lives. It says 5 at the bottom, but there's actually a 0th life, so... This thing right here, the Turk head, if you get that, um... Turk comes up and tells you the controls. But, I already know the controls, so... Um... I don't need to click on that. This is a pineapple. The pineapples give you, um, more health bar, but they don't give you health along with it. As you can just see there. Your main weapon is fruit. You can throw that at your enemies. And you have two throws. You have an overhand throw, and you have an underhand throw. Like that. Like, see? Uh, the butterfly is a checkpoint. If you die, um, that's where you'll respawn at. If you still have health, if you still have lives left. If you run out of lives, then you get a game over. But if you still have lives left, that's your checkpoint. So you'll respawn right here when you die. If you even touch an enemy, you lose health. You can't jump on them or anything. This isn't Mario. See, the bananas just restored my health. That was actually a close call right there. Um, you can crawl along. I'm gonna try to do this. The controls are a bit wonky, but I actually make it look worse than it actually is. There we go. You can climb along the tree like this. And there are different kinds of fruit fr fruits for you to collect. Like this is the, um, the red fruit. Hold on. Like your normal fruit is this brown fruit. And you actually have unlimited ammo for that. The other fruits you have like a, um, limited amount of. I'm gonna see if I can figure this out here um what are my controls through this hold on um there we go i never really use the special fruits because i can do just fine with the but that like splits into different parts and stuff Like that, so you can get the enemy in one hit because it splits into lots of pieces. But, I rarely use the special fruits because they're not really necessary. I can get along just fine with the, um, the, uh, default fruit. 
Okay. This is the letter T. You can get all the letters to um spell like this is your um collection menu right here. You could get all the letters to spell Tarzan. It happens in each level. Um if you get all the letters to spell Tarzan, then you unlock a um clip from the movie Tarzan. But um I'm not really going to show you those clips because of copyright. And if you've seen the movie, you've already seen the clips, so it's not really that big of a deal. But I'm going to try to get most of the letters to spell Tarzan in this game anyway, just to um show you guys where all these things are in case you do want to 100% the game, even though I don't remember where everything is because it's been a long time since I've played this game. Um, there we go. Hold on. There's another checkpoint. You can climb trees by jumping on them and just climbing straight up. And then we have our secondary weapon, the knife right here. And I hardly ever use this. You have, um, two things you can do with it. You can slash with it, and you can stab with it. But I don't remember what weapon I have for stab right now, so... Um... Because, once again, I never really... Okay. I'll show you. So you can stab with it, or you can slash with it. Okay, this is the blue fruit. And I can show you how that works. It's kind of like a grenade. Let me show you. So it will harm any enemy on the screen, even if it doesn't actually hit them. So... Um, watch. See, I aimed the other way and it didn't hit it. So, that was a sketch that has like a picture of a monkey on it. It's one fourth of it. There's three quarters of a sketch hidden in each level. If you get all of them, you get to play a bonus round. And I like the bonus rounds, they're really fun. So I'm going to go ahead and try to get all these. That's where the second one is. Hold on. There we go. I'll head this way. There's the Z. Oh, stupid monkey. Okay, there we go. Now you can bounce on animals' backs to get stuff. And I'm going to get an extra life at the end of this level because um because I did get 100 coins. I want to get that last coin over there. Come on. You gotta throw fruit at these to get them to move. But here we go. Ow! Oh, I said it almost at the same time as he did. That's funny. We'll go this way. There's the end. And I really hate these ones that sit in the trees and throw stuff at you. Okay. There should be one more sketch here. Did I get... Okay, I got all the letters spelled Tarzan. The last sketch is over here. Um, right here. There we go. I don't know why that froze on me a second there. That was weird. Okay. So here's our summary screen of all the stuff we got. Okay. So we're going to play our bonus round here, Jungle Cruise. And the thing about bonus rounds is that they're timed. They're basically a way for you to get extra lives by collecting coins and stuff. There are pineapples around here that you can... um collect to um get more time and I, I'm stuck on this rock I hate it when that happens and you can actually get to the endings of these things but you need to be constantly collecting the pineapples to get more time and these are really just short little fun rounds and stuff it would be nice to get an extra life around here and I think I'm going to because this first bonus round is really easy
Look at that, I did it. Okay. Cool. Let's go on the next level. Going ape. Okay. This is a pretty fun level. It wasn't one of my favorites when I was younger, but it's pretty fun. We got the knife right at the beginning of the level, but once again, I don't really use the knife. Um, I might use it on this frog. Because it's an annoying little creature. I'll use it on this warthog, like this. There we go. That's how the knife works. But most of the time I just use the fruit because it's easier. Because there's a longer range. I really like the music in this game, too. Head this way. here. There's our pineapple. And you can swing on vines and stuff. Once you get the hang of vine swinging, it's pretty easy, but there's our checkpoint. I'm gonna try to kill this stupid monkey here. There we go. I heard it die. There we go. We'll head this way. There's birds dropping coconuts on you. It gets really annoying. Um, there we go. Ooh, these raccoons can be pretty annoying too. I got the pineapple. Frogs, they're so annoying. Most of the time you have to use the underhand throw because the overhand throw won't, won't really get them. And I'm gonna break through this. What fruits do I have now? I'm gonna check. I just have that one, okay. I think the final one, like the dark purple one is just like a more powerful fruit. It's kind of lame. Um, we'll get that thing. And then I'm gonna head back here. Because we're gonna go back onto the tree a different route so that we can, um... So we can get the, um... the other coins that were there. There's some bananas. Um, there's the R. We'll get the bananas there. Oop. Okay, this vine can be pretty tricky to get, so you have to time your jump like that. It's harder than it looks. There we go. I'll get that. There's the bananas. Um... There's the Z. And we can't get the sketch quite yet because we're not over at that area yet, but we will be heading there in a minute. Like this. I gotta do the underhand throw. Oh, wrong button. Hold on. There we go. We're not going that way yet because we need to get the sketch. Oop.
Here we go. Look at that sketch. Head this way. Go down here. Get the bananas. We'll head this way a little bit. We're not going to go down there yet because we're going to break through this. There's the A. See, if we had gone down the other way, we wouldn't have been over here to get, like, the A and stuff. We're coming up on a tricky part here. And in later levels, it can get very, very annoying. We're not going to go up there yet. We're going to go this way. First. There we go. And we've got all the those things now, but now we're going to head up here. We'll get the bananas. Nothing like some nice tree surfing, but this part can be really, really tricky. See, you can see I missed some coins right there. Oh, man. you got to time these just right, too. Okay, we'll do this. Jump. I ducked there. I don't know why he did that. That was weird. Okay, is there anything this way? Nope, it's just a warthog. Stupid warthog. Okay. We're gonna get three extra lives at the end of this level. Look at that. We can do the bonus round, too. Stork ride. Same deal here. Collect pineapples and coins and stuff. Collect pineapples for more times. Collect coins for more health. Here we go. Sorry about that, guys. I have a bit of a runny nose today, but we'll do okay. Getting all these coins. I missed that pineapple there, but I think we're going to make it to the level. Oh, and I'm not going to get a spare life. That's too bad. If I had just gotten a few more coins. Oh, well. Let's go to the next level. The elephant hair dare. Okay. I love this level because I love the music. It's really catchy. There it is. Just listen to that wonderful music. It's so catchy. Dun, dun, dun. See how catchy that is? But that monkey is driving me nuts. Okay. Things are a bit trickier to find in this level, but we will get all of them. I just love this music. So catchy. No oh, stupid thing. Oh, uh, this could get pretty annoying because this elephant just walks back and forth, just walks from one end of the screen to the other, and you have to bounce on his back to get the coins. So if he's at the opposite end, you have to wait for him to walk all the way back. It, can get pretty annoying. There's a lot of bouncing on elephants' backs and stuff. And the rhino, there's a rhino later, and the rhino actually can hurt you, but 
Um, I'm not going to bother with the rest of those coins, it's two coins. Okay. We'll go ahead and go this way. Ah, oh, there goes the music. When the music goes away, you have to, like, die in order to get the music to restart. It's kind of sad, because I really like that music. But, oh well. I'm thinking about dying on purpose just to, um, just so that I can hear the music again, but I don't know. Ah, that's better. Yeah, I'll go ahead and die. Like this. So we can hear that music again. It'll be fun. Here we go. Yeah, listen to that. I have plenty of lives. I'll be fine. Okay, so there's the Z. Get the coin, there you go. There's a sketch. Ah, screw that. Not getting that. This game could drive me nuts sometimes. That was just one coin. I'll be fine. why I stopped to collect the fruit because I never use it but here we go oh the music's gonna stop again isn't it oh well Got all the sketches we still need two more letters there should be a letter right there i think we're almost done with this level anyway so we'll be fine the next level is complete and utter chaos though here's that elephant again boing head this way There's the letter. I hate this part. It's so hard to time your jump to get there. Oh, here's that stupid rhino. The way you get it to move is you have to throw fruit at its butt. So... And if you land on its head or on its butt, you lose health, so... this way. I'll just collect a bunch of coins here. And gators can hurt you too, so. Watch out for those. Um, I, I already have full health, so I'm not going to bother with those. There we go. 
We're over by the elephants to get that elephant here that Turk told us to get. If you've seen the movie, you know what I'm talking about. But that's that event right there that it was showing. So let's play the bonus round. And this is the harder version of Jungle Cruise. And I wish I could get those three pineapples. I've got them a few times that I've played. Because they give you like a um, truckload of um, health. But, yeah. You see how catchy the music in this game is? There's a few tracks, there's a few um, songs from the movie in this game also, but we'll get to those soon. Head this way. We're gonna get another life, and we're gonna get to the end of this. Look at that. Okay, next level. Stampede. Okay, this is like the elephant chase from the movie. You'll recognize this if you've seen the movie, you know. You know what part this was. And what happens in this level is just Tarzan keeps running. You can't really do anything to make him stop, and that's actually a good thing, because if these elephants catch you, they kick you into the camera, and it's really annoying. It's kind of tricky to get all the sketches in this level, too, so if I don't get them, I'm just going to tell you that um, the bonus level is just a harder version of um, the Stork Ride game. Which you've already, you've already seen the easier version, and the hard version isn't really all that different from the easy version. Well, I got three out of four sketches, so this should be good. These things, you have to go on them to get perfects, but they also slow you down a bunch. I'm just going to show what happens when they... Yeah, that's what happens when they, you die right there. But I'm not... I'm going to try not to do that again, because it's really annoying. And what's annoying is these these apes keep getting in your way. And yep, we're going to do the harder version of Stork, right? Because I got all the sketches. We should be nearing the end of this level now. And these elephants are nearing me. And yes, I've won. I've won. We made it. We made it. Good. Awesome. Look at that. We got a spare life to boot, too. Okay. Let's go to the bonus round. It's the harder version of Stork Ride. See, in this one, you actually have to fly to get some of the coins. Like that. Sorry if I'm not talking as much as I probably should be, but I'm just trying to concentrate on this game really well. You just press your jump button multiple times to fly and stuff. this. Okay. There we go. Okay. On to the next level. And it's coming of age. So we finally get to play as the grown-up Tarzan. Because this takes place years later when he's grown up and our knife is right back here. They hit it right behind you. So if you don't ever go to the left, you never find the knife. It's kind of weird, but... We'll head this way. Get the coins. Ow. 
And this level, it's really hard to find everything in. I've Most of the time I play this level, I can't find everything, so... Starting from here, I'm probably not going to be getting everything. I'm going to try to find everything, but I don't know if I will find everything. Because it is quite a tricky level, but... Here's the Rhino all grown up now. Not Rhino from Spider-Man, of course, but... And as you can hear, this is actually a song from the Tarzan movie. Right here. Oh, come on! Yeah, I gotta go higher on the vine. There we go. You gotta bounce on this tree just right to get these coins. And I'm not gonna bother because I'll just bounce across there, get our first sketch. And head this way. Get the R. Oh yeah, these spit coins at you too. Oh, that's just a fruit. I'm not gonna bother with that. You don't throw things at me, I throw things at you. Come over here. There we go. If you ground pound on this, things will fall from the tree. Uh, but I'm not gonna spend my time doing that. It'll eventually run out of coins, but it takes a long time, so I'm not even gonna try that. Just head up the, the tree right here. Um, like this. Oh. There's a thing. There's a sketch. There's the Z. I wanted to go up there. Okay, I gotta climb higher on the vine, apparently. There we go. I'm probably gonna die because they keep running into me, but. I'll get those bananas back there because I really need some health. Okay, we'll go this way. this. Now 
Now there's a sketch back there, but since I couldn't find, but it's sketch number four, and since I couldn't figure out where sketch number three is, I'm just not gonna bother. Yeah, I'll go ahead and show you where it is. It's back here, but since I can't figure out where sketch number three is, and I have found it before, but I can't remember where. But the level is the tree. The bonus round is the tree surfing. Which we will see harder versions of later, so you'll still get to see that bonus round. You just won't get to see the easiest version of it. But you will get to see the bonus round eventually. You'll get to see all the, the bonus rounds that are in this game. But anyway, I got all the letters to spell Tarzan, so once again we're going to unlock the movie clip, but... Once again, you guys aren't going to be able to see the movie clips because I'm not going to show them to you because of copyright. But if you've seen the movie, you've already seen all the clips because they're right from the movie. So there's, there's the umbrella. And this is the first time we're not doing a bonus round, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, so let's go on to the next level. Sabor attacks. Now, Sabor, if you remember from the movie, um, Sabor is that cheetah, the cheetah that killed um, Tarzan's parents. And we have to attack him with a spear. So, um, only Tarzan doesn't know that Sabor actually killed his parents. It's, he's just trying to defend his, um, eight friends from the, um, from the, from the cheetah, Sabor. Excuse me. Or bless me, I don't know what the proper term is. Go this way. There's that stupid rhino again. There's our first sketch. There's a stupid monkey that I need to kill. There we go. There's the knife. And I find it weird that he doesn't get the knife until now because I know the spear was broken. But couldn't he have used the spearhead to, like, kill enemies with? But it doesn't matter since I never used the knife anyway. But you might want to, so that's why I'm showing you where these things are. Oh, uh, we could ground pound this. There we go. There's the letter R. So we spell the word tar. Because he's a Xan of Tar. That was a lame joke. I'm sorry. These stupid eagles that'll fly around, too, they're really annoying. We'll kill this monkey here. trying to get that sketch. You gotta bump, jump high enough to do it. Come on. We'll get that. There we go. We'll jump up here, climb this cliff, and that eagle got me. These eagles are so annoying. 
<laughs> That's really annoying. Okay. And Sabor is back, so... Oh, wrong button. And now there's an eagle flying around that can hit me as well. Ow. That was... And now Sabor runs away again, and we have to fight him one more time, so we'll run to find him again. Before he, um, yeah. We have to fight him one more time to kill him, so. And there's the sketch. Head this way. Oh look, that Sabor right there. We can't fight him right now, but I like that little effect in the background. That's a nice touch. And up here, our sketch is hidden up here, so I'll go ahead and get that. Oh, that that was terrible. I gotta remember not to do that. That's just stupid. Oh, I just landed on the thorns. Yeah, I got all the sketches. There's two more letters to spell Tarzi, and right now we just have Tars, which is pretty unimpressive, but... There's the A. Yeah, I'm betting the end was on the other side of that vine, but I can't get up there anymore. Oh, uh, well. We probably won't get the end then, unless it's over here instead. But I doubt it. Yeah, we're not gonna get it. We missed it. Oh wait, it might be. No, it's not. Yep, we missed it. We missed the end. Oh well. That stupid eagle. eagle is gonna kill me. Oh, cool, we did it. Awesome. Look at that. We missed the end, though. That's, that's too bad. Oh, well. Let's do the bonus round, and this is Jungle Cruise, only this time we use Turk instead of Tarzan. And Turk is one of the most annoying characters in Tarzan. I think, I think he's really annoying. Um. Here we go. We get these things. Now there's waterfalls too. So it's even harder than it was with the hard mode on Tarzan. And there's an even harder mode for the Turk Jungle Cruise um, later in the game. But we'll get to that later. We're gonna get another life here. Look at that. Okay, next level. The Baboon Chase. Now this is similar to the elephant level, where, um, yeah, 
where we have to um, just keep running. But I think this is a bit easier than the elephant level. Well, not easier for collecting things. I think it's easier to collect the things in the elephant level, but it's easier to escape from the baboons in this level than it was to escape from the elephants in the previous level. Oh. Why did I do that? Well, I did miss a sketch back here, so I'm going to see if I could get this. Okay, good, I did. I doubt I'm going to get all of them because the last half of this level... It's really tricky to get the sketches in because you have to know precisely where they are, and I do know where they are, but it's still really hard to get them even then. Um. There we go. We're gonna go ahead and go this way, and then Tarzan will grab us and we'll be tree surfing. And when there's gonna be um, baboons coming at ya. And you have to open your umbrella to stop them. Here we go. Just like in the movie. Oh. go. And I missed the end. And I'm probably going to miss the sketch here, but... But once again, I think the level's just one we've already done. Oh, nope, we got it. We're going to do the level. Actually, I think it's tree surfing, which you guys haven't gotten to see yet, but... Which appears three times in this game, so we still would have seen it anyway, even if I hadn't gotten it in this level. So we'll be fine. We didn't get all the letters to spell Tarzan, but we got all the sketches, so we'll go on to the bonus round. Tree surfing, okay. Don't you just love the music in this game? Oh, we made it to the end of that level. I hardly ever make it to the end of tree surfing. That's impressive. Okay. Cool. Well, let's go on to the next level. Trashing the camp. Okay, this level is pretty fun. And you'll recognize the music in this level, too, because it was in the movie. We get to play as Turk in this level. And I don't really like playing as Turk because... He can't throw fruit or hold a knife, so he's pretty much defenseless against his enemies. He can ground pound, and he can crouch, but that's just about it. He's basically a lamer version of Tarzan. But the level itself is pretty fun. And this thing. There's our letter this way. Okay. I just love this music. I don't know if people will agree with me on this or not, but I actually prefer, um, I actually prefer um, this version of the music over the one actually used in the movie. It's just more catchy. It's 
very catchy. Uh, yeah. There's our... Oh, I should have gone up there first. Oh, well. Before we break that box, we have to jump on here because there's a sketch up here. There we go. Now we can break the box. And there's the bananas to restore our health. And a dude throwing things at us to take away our health. I mean, I know they're not doing that on purpose, but... Could they just please keep it down? We'll jump on an elephant here. What I needed. Just what I needed. I want to hear the music again, but it's. Yeah, it's. I'm not going to bother. Whatever. Keep going up this way. We'll break this. Nothing. Okay. Oh, that paper is really hard to get. You have to have him fling you up here, and you have to time it just right. Oh, I got it one try, though. That was awesome. That rarely ever happens. And the chances of it happening in a Let's Play are even worse. Wow, that was awesome. I don't... Get that coin, you stupid thing. There you go. Is that everything? Nope, there's one more sketch piece somewhere. There we go. I'm just gonna head to the end of the level. Actually, let's get some more coins. Another life will do. I guess I can't get another life out of this, okay. I could get those coins over there, but I'm not gonna bother going through there again. Oh wait, there we go. We're gonna get more coins this way. There we go. Two extra lives at the end of this level. This is awesome. Get the umbrella. And we're all set. There we go. Awesome. All the letters. All the papers. And two more lives. We have 21 lives now. Okay. Let's do the bonus round. And this one's really fun. It's called Jungle Jumping. We'll be up there jumping in a minute, but I'm going to get a bunch of pineapples to make this easier. Uh, I'm not going to bother with that one. Where's coin collected over here? Get that.
Can't get that. I can't believe I actually got 100 coins in Jungle Jump, and that's amazing. Okay. Campsite commotion. You'll recognize this music, too. Because this music was in the movie. We'll go ahead and get these coins. and get the um, bananas. I think we got them already, okay. Break this. Get the pineapple. Head this way. up there get the a right there um, and then we'll head over here um, I don't know if there's okay we can't go that way we'll go this way boom to go back this way. Oh, not that way, but up on this thing. There we go. As you can see, this is the same campsite from um, Trash in the Camp. Oh, that could have gone better. Wow. I don't do well here. Okay, there we go. Nothing there, so we'll go this way. Get the pineapple. That was kind of annoying. Oh, that that wasn't very nice. Why did it do that to me? I forgot about that. That's just annoying. There's our next sketch. There should be one more over here somewhere. There's the... Oh, we missed the R. I don't know where that was. Oh, well. Oh, 
We'll head this way. There's the last sketch. Head this way. Break these. And what's interesting is even though the umbrella's here, you can jump over and collect a few more coins this way. If you want. But once again, I don't know where that R is, so we'll just head over here. Okay, so let's do that bonus round. And this is jungle jumping, but this time it's a Tarzan instead of Turk. So. Head this way. And also it's at night instead of during the day, and that's kind of cool, so. We'll go ahead and go this way, get the pineapples. I love the music in this level. Okay, yep, that's the end. Okay, on to the next level. Journey to the Treehouse. Oh man, this level gave me pains when I tried to play it as a kid. The music is kind of creepy also, see? It still is like that jungle feel to it and everything. But this level really is tricky right here. With the exception of the level that comes after this, the last few levels actually are really tricky. But I'll do the best I can here. Oh, why did I do that? Okay. Okay, good. Jump. Because that breaks, so. There's a gator down here. I didn't need to go that way, but. Ow. Got this way. Jump on this vine. There's gonna be a lot of vine swinging in this level. It's one of the hardest levels of the game. But we're not that far from the end of the game now. We just have to... Have to get to the end of the game. Because if you remember when he went to the treehouse and saw the, um... Picture of his family with him as a baby, that was actually near the end of the movie. So we're near the end of the game now. It's just not the easiest level to play through. And once again, here's the rhino that you have to throw fruit at its butt. There we go. There we go. To get it to move. Because otherwise you can't get the stuff up here because the rhino never moves. So I'll throw fruit at its buttocks, right there. Yeah. 
once again, you don't want to bounce on his head or on his butt because it'll hurt you. So there we go. See? Man. Oh well. I'll go up there in a minute. We gotta go this way first to get some things. There's a lot of fruit in this level, but I never use it, so... There we go. I always just use the default fruit that you have unlimited of. Head this way. We'll go over here. There we go. This is by far the hardest part of the game right here. All this vine swinging. See what I mean? If you don't time it just right, you die. But luckily we get to hear the music again, so that's a good thing. Okay, we made it there. Now this can get really tricky because you have to keep bouncing off these nests and stuff to get to your vine. So if I time this just right. There. And you have to do it just right or he won't make it. Nothing that way, okay. I think that green bird can hurt you too, which is really weird, but I think there's a checkpoint coming up here, so if I die here, at least I'll make it there, but yeah. Once I pass, pass that butterfly, that's a checkpoint. Oh, come on! That was so stupid. Okay. Yeah, I... I'm going about it all wrong. I hate this level. Well, I don't hate this level. I actually really like this level, but it does have... It does go a bit too far with... The annoyingness. Maybe I gotta get lower on the vine. That's what I gotta do. Yeah. Oops. Okay. What am I doing wrong here? I usually do really well at this level. I really hope I don't waste all my lives here. What am I doing wrong here? I usually make it past this part. Yeah, this is driving me nuts. There's got to be something wrong with the game here. Okay, I'll climb up a little bit higher on the vine. See what happens. Wow. Gonna end up losing all my lives here. Wow. 
What in the world? What am I doing wrong here? I'm gonna cut ahead in the video. I'm gonna look up a video of how to do this, and I'm gonna cut out the part. Okay, guys? Well, actually, I got it on my next try, so... I don't know what was up with that. Maybe my fingers just needed a break. I watched a video of how to do it, and they did it the exact same way I was doing it. And I'm like, why didn't that work for me? So I just w started doing it again, and suddenly it worked. I guess my fingers just needed a rest. I don't know. So I'm going to cut out that long pause there. For past, oh, there's still some more annoying stuff coming up, but like this thing, stupid bats. And you have to use your knife on these because they don't work with the fruit. But wow, that was annoying. There's our last sketch. I don't think we're going to get all the letters unless they're somewhere... Yeah, I don't know where they are. They might be in these things, but... You land on the wrong part of that and it breaks and you fall to your death. That's really annoying, but that's what happens. But we're at the end of the level now. Thank goodness. Yeah, I don't know where those last two letters are. Oh well. We got all the sketches. And we actually get a bonus round that's actually... This is the only time you see this bonus round in the game. It doesn't appear anywhere else. Turk and Tantor's Great Escape. And this is kind of similar to the elephant level, only not as annoying. And this is actually based off of something that happened in the movie, if you've seen the movie. And this is the same music from Jungle Jumpin', and you know I love that music, so... It's great. We'll keep running here, get pineapples. Yeah, I love this music. Keep running here. The level goes on for a bit before it ends. Keep running here. Here we go. We're gonna make it. Look at that, we did it. Okay. There are three more levels to go, and this next level is very easy. Rocking the boat. And the music on this level is pretty catchy, too. I probably shouldn't have gotten all the bananas right there, but... Oh, if you on them while you're moving, I guess they hurt you. I forgot about that. And there will be bad guys on this boat trying to hurt you. And you can kill them, but then they just respawn.
focus and stuff. This is the only level where you don't have to, where the items, where you don't encounter the items in order. I'll just show you how they respawn and everything. It's really annoying. The last level doesn't have sketches in it, but it does have letters. But I'm not going to get all the letters in the final level because it's a hard level as it is. So, um, we'll go ahead and climb up this thing. We don't want to go that way yet because there's a sketch back here. Hold on. There we go. My mic failed for a second there. I don't know what was up with that. But okay. Uh, we'll keep going here. I hope my mic wasn't cutting out through the whole thing, because that would mean I just wasted a bunch of stuff, but... Ah, uh, screw that. I'm not getting those coins. Not going on that rope again. You know what? I'm going to pause the game while I fix my mic. Did that work? I think it did. Okay, good. Okay. Hopefully there will be no more interruptions. My mic was giving me problems. It's one of those um, earbud mic things. But this will hopefully work. And I guess those birds can hurt me. Who thought little bluebirds could be so harmful? Okay. Jump down here, get these. There's a thing up there. And I know where the last one is. We will be getting that. Jump up here. Climb the ladder. Get those coins and that sketch. And, um, here we go. Look at that. Did it. Two more levels to go, and we're done. We'll do this bonus round, which is Jungle Cruise with Turk again. The hardest version yet. Lead down here. Run this way. Get these coins. And then... There we go. We There we go. Two more levels to go. So let's get on with it. Tarzan to the rescue. All right. Let's rescue our eight friends from those evil hunters. Pineapple. Yeah. 
I think the knife is in one of these boxes, but yeah, it is. But once again, I never use the knife, so I don't know why I bother collecting it. And these bats can get really annoying sometimes. I'm just going to ignore them because they're hard to kill. There's a crocodile in here. Now if we break all these things, we can get a um, bonus coin or something. But we also have to duck and walk around these like hollow areas because they'll die if we don't do that. Yeah, this was a part that I had trouble with a lot. See what I mean? I even I even messed up that time, but we'll do it. We'll do it. It's a lot easier now that I'm older. But you have to time your ducking just right or you won't make it. Because he only ducks for half a second. And no, we're not going to get those bonus coins, but it doesn't matter. So we got the sketch. And then this part is really hard, too. You have to throw fruit to hit the barrel-throwing dude so that he won't throw barrels at you. But you've got to do it just right for him. Okay. If you get too close, he starts throwing barrels at you. And they take away a lot of health. So it's important to try to... I don't know if that's a cheat method or not, but... This guy's easy to defeat right here. And then our little ape friend gets free over there. And then we do the same thing over here. See, you don't want to get too close because they throw those at a wide range there. die already. Pat it with waiting for you guys there. Okay, now this guy is holding a box. If we walk under it, he'll actually drop it on our heads. So we gotta like throw fruit at him to like distract him. Because if it falls on our heads, we die instantly. There. Okay. So we'll get this guy. And then once again, cage holding dude here. Okay, good. Last level. But first we get to do our bonus round. And then we'll go on to the last level. Okay. Let's do our bonus round. Tree surfing again. And, um... Oops. Oops. 
Here we go. Oh, cool. Made it to the end of that one, too. Okay, on to the final level. Conflict with Clayton. This is the final level. This is the guy who's been trying to, um, kill our ape friends over here. And I'm not even gonna attempt to get all the letters, and there are no sketches in this level, so we don't have to worry about that. The last three levels are really tricky to get, so I'm not going to bother. Um, we'll keep going this way. And we'll keep going here. This is, this is really fun. We should be nearing the top now. Yep, we're almost there. Okay. I can see the top now. Yep, there we are. Okay. We gotta keep throwing food at him and dodging his weapons. Oh, yep, there we go. We did it. That was fast. Usually that takes me a while. You did it? I can't believe it. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty much all we get at the end of the game. It's a good game, but that's that's just a lame ending right there. Congratulations, game's complete. Yep, that's the end of the game. It's kind of lame that pretty much all we get at the end of the game is a congratulations screen, but, uh, whatever. The rest of the game makes up for that. It's really fun. I really, really highly recommend this game because of how fun it is, the, the music. It's a game I really enjoyed as a kid. It's a game I still enjoy now. And, yeah... We'll just get done with the credits here, and then, um, I don't know what game I'll be doing next or anything, but, um, I've got a few games on my mind that I might be doing, but we'll get to those some other time, I don't know when. But yeah, hopefully, hopefully very, very soon. So yeah, that was, that was Tarzan. And this is Kurt the Gamer signing off.